Week 10 for Friday Night Lights was supposed to have all three defending champs in action, but with Fairhaven's game now moved to tomorrow, it left us with two 2017 state champs. That included a rematch from the Division III title game with Windsor, the 2017 champs, at top-seeded Woodstock. Only one team could advance this year. Woodstock going to have a lot of success on the ground. A big reason why was Ben Marscabardi in the sweep. He's faster than just about everyone in the Wasp are on the board first. Second quarter, they hold that lead. It's another sweep to Micah Schalbeck. It's a foggy night as well, and the end zones were, well, they still had the ball in there and doesn't have any trouble finding it. Wasps are up 20 to 6. So Windsor going to start taking some shots. Robert Slocum is looking end zone, can't deliver much better than this to Ryland Richardson. Yellow Jackets trying to get some momentum going, but not everything can go smoothly. Windsor recovers an onside kick, and Charlie Amato does not like that. He'll take it away for Woodstock. That possession will end the Caden White punching it in. From there, Woodstock absolutely running away with it, quite literally, in fact, 55 to 13. Two alumni field, St. Johnsbury and Rutland, both looking to return to a state championship next week. Get your popcorn ready. There were some fireworks early on. Raiders set the tone on their opening drive. Ryan Moore fakes the handoff to Dakota Peters instead, floats it to him for the touchdown. They'll take it 7 0 Rutland. Hilltoppers answer back with Jake Cady. Fling it to Rennick Smith. Stiff arms a defender, and he would get off to the races down the sideline. Some 69 yards for the touchdown. We have a tie ball game at Lucky Sevens. In the second quarter, Raiders start to pull away. Moore unloads deep to Lucas Hubbard, who makes a spectacular diving catch. Raiders cash in on the next play to make it 21 to 7. On their next possession, handoff to Peters. He bowls through the defender on his way to the end zone. One of his five touchdowns. Raiders defense forces six Hilltopper turnovers, and Rutland is headed to the state championship with a 48-23 blowout win.